5 Types of Rights and How to Invest in Them What are rights? Real estate investment trusts, rights, are a key consideration when constructing any equity or fixed income portfolio. Their ability to generate dividend income along with capital appreciation makes them an excellent counterbalance to stocks, bonds, and cash. Rights own and or manage income producing commercial real estate, whether it's the properties themselves or the mortgages on those properties. Types of Rights Number 1. Retail Rights Approximately 24% of right investments are in shopping malls and freestanding retail. This represents the single biggest investment by type in the world. Whatever shopping center you frequent, it's likely owned by a right. It's important to remember that retail rights make money from the rent they charge tenants. If retailers are experiencing cash flow problems due to poor sales, it's possible they could delay or even default on those monthly payments, eventually being forced into bankruptcy. Number 2. Residential Rights These are rights that own and operate multifamily rental apartment buildings as well as manufactured housing. When looking to invest in this type of right, one should consider several factors before jumping in. For instance, the best apartment markets tend to be where home affordability is low relative to the rest of the country. In metropolitan cities like Mumbai and Delhi, the high cost of single homes forces more people to rent, which drives up the price landlords can charge each month. As a result, the biggest residential rights tend to focus on large urban centers. Number 3. Healthcare Rights Healthcare rights will be an interesting subsector to watch as healthcare costs continue to climb. Healthcare rights invest in the real estate of hospitals, medical centers, nursing facilities, and retirement homes. The success of this real estate is directly tied to the healthcare system. A majority of the operators of these facilities rely on occupancy fees, Medicare and Medicaid reimbursements as well as private pay. As long as the funding of healthcare is a question mark, so are healthcare rights. Number 4. Office Rights Office rights invest in office buildings. They receive rental income from tenants who have usually signed long-term leases. Number 5. Mortgage Rights Approximately 10% of right investments are in mortgages as opposed to the real estate itself. Just because this type of right invests in mortgages instead of equity doesn't mean it comes without risks. An increase in interest rates would translate into a decrease in mortgage right book values, driving stock prices lower. In addition, mortgage rights get a considerable amount of their capital through secured and unsecured debt offerings. Should interest rates rise, future financing will be more expensive, reducing the value of a portfolio of loans. In a low interest rate environment with the prospect of rising rates, most mortgage rights trade at a discount to net asset value per share. The trick is finding the right one. Thank you for watching. Subscribe to Smart Acreage. For more investment and real estate related videos.